the biggest expense in Medicaid in this county, in the state of California, is for psychotropic drugs for foster children, <laughs> for jacking these kids up on medicine, for using drugs to control children. I mean, look at yourself and ask, what kind of people do that? I mean, these are children, you know? I, I, did you see the video of the 14-year-old girl in Texas? I, she's crying for her mommy. Mama, mama, I want my mama. She's wearing a bathing suit. I mean, what kind of threat is that? She's a 14-year-old girl. I think judges, I think we've really gone to sleep on the job. I really do. I mean, U.S. law is justice by strangers. I mean, you know it. You keep yourself separate. You do that, but... I, I just don't believe in it. The way that we resolved things was we kept it within the village. You know, we would go to elders if we needed to, but we did not go to strangers. When I was on the bench in San Francisco, the way that I made it work for me was that I used values that I was familiar with, which meant that I treated the people that appeared in front of me as if they were my family. I don't think, I really don't feel like I judge. I help people meet their responsibilities. To me, the whole problem is that nobody learned that justice is what the law is really about. Of course, we need rules. Every society needs rules. But the whole point of having a law and having a process and having courts is to ensure fairness, right behavior, and justice. It's not about that anymore. It's about money and whoever has the power to. I think this country is really broken. I really do.